through discussing with the different gas laws that describe fundamental properties of gas, such as the number of moles or amount of gas, volume, pressure, and temperature. All this information about gases is described on one theory. The Kinetic Molecular Theory Kinetic molecular theory of gas or KMT is a generalization that explains the behavior of individual gas particles. KMT introduced the following informations describing the gas particles. The KMT or kinetic molecular assumptions are, are, are as follows. Number one, gas molecules have negligible mass and volume. Number two, gas molecules constantly and rapidly move in random directions. Number three, gas molecules have negligible intermolecular forces. And number four, the average kinetic energy of molecules in a gas sample is proportional to its temperature. Now, let's discuss each KMT assumption on gas particles. First, gas molecules have negligible mass and volume. Gas is a very small particle and have the least mass if we will compare it to solid and liquid. And because of this, sometimes gas mass and volume are not observed or difficult to measure. Gas exhibit compressibility and expansibility. These two properties depend on pressure and temperature. Example is the ability of the gas to compress and expand on on its own container. Having a decrease on the pressure and temperature of the gas give it an ability to expand, while increasing its temperature and pressure giving a gas a compression inside its container. Next is the gas molecules constantly and rapidly move in random direction. Just like another state of matter, gas also has the ability to move. Their movement is based on the energy or kinetic energy, but unlike solid and liquid, gas has the greater ability to move because of the less force that attract each particle of a gas. Gas molecules undergo perfectly elastic collision as they bump with one another and with the walls of their container. During collision, energy may transfer from one molecule to another, but the total energy of all molecules in the system is conserved. Third assumption, gas molecules have negligible intermolecular forces that gives the gas particle to diffuse easily from its container. Repulsion or attractive forces between and among gas molecules are so weak that they can freely move. It is the reason why the smell of something on the same area is easily scattered on that area. Once someone farted on an open space, the smell of the fart was automatically scattered and can be smelled all around the area. The last one is that the average kinetic energy of the molecules in a gas sample is proportional to its temperature. The motion of gas particles depends on the temperature of the gas. As the temperature increases, the gas molecules move faster, or as the temperature decreases, the gas particles move slower. So that's it for the kinetic molecular theory. Just remember then, 
on the kinetic molecular theory, the following are described. Number one, gas molecules have negligible mass and volume. Number two, gas molecules constantly and rapidly move in random direction. Number three, gas molecules have negligible intermolecular forces. Number four, the average kinetic energy of the molecules in a gas sample is proportional to its temperature. So that's it. Thank you very much, great students. You're gonna proceed to your task activity. Thank you.